There we go, this is a match between HCCP and Abacan. Abacan have assumed the blue role and HCCP the red. Playing op 4. The match is played on the map, on the map Wind, which is a fortified position in the center of a hill backed by a farm. Now we see the rush here. HCCP brings two UAZs and uh, the SPG UAZ. Trying to maybe to catch a truck, as you can see, yeah, back in here, make a big push with many vehicles too. Now we get the SPG shot. He's on the fire by HML and Shinji is killed, but HML is destroyed too. DDD is killed too. How did that happen? Look is on the overwatch of the back side of the castle. Simmons moves the truck behind the farm. Master is moving with the truck to a higher ground above the behind the farm and above the castle. Alex is already there, getting a side with the machine gun. Bit of a glitch with the graphics here. And Abakan has managed to capture the castle. Now we get a massive uh, Respawn by up four, and now they're gonna make a big push together. The match is played on a six and six bases. Hillion will have trouble from the Humvee that's guarding the backside. Now we get massive spamming to the castle with GP25s. The Humvee has not spotted him, they're just watching the frontal side. They destroyed one UAZ to get more points. And now Siemens is guarding the backside of the base. Now the objective we get grenade throws. Alexia is trying to reposition to guard the side where the tentacle tent is when enemy tries to make run for it. Hydram is killed by Alexia with the MG. He's on here, is looking at the backside, and now he has spot an enemy. He's shooting at him. Lion is trying to do something here, but he's injured. I managed, a million managed to get two kills. Lashendri get by Mesa, and Alexis get by Lashendri. Big fight going on out there. Both teams have. Uh, Pushed all their forces towards the main objective. They do not have made any any aggression towards the main road to try to make a circling move. Only Siemens, I think, is uh, guarding the back side of the objective base. Alliance trying to make to get a better position. Lion gets a kill here from the medical tent to an enemy. Now Abagan is pushing forward with the tank and HCCP manages to hold the objective. Now they're trying to get into position and Lion is trying to get an RPG here to do something with the tank. And the tank fires on the bunker and it's destroyed. Takes down with him Lion. The tank is going to the back side. Now there's going to be a lot of trouble for HCCP. Trying to find it, find it all. The truck. And I think he spotted it. No, not yet. He hasn't spotted the truck yet. He's just trying to. He misses it completely. It's kind of strange. 
Mr. misses the truck and goes down the hill. Well, there's a fierce battle inside the base. We're losing them in dead bodies here. The plane is six versus six, and this made, makes them up a bit over a bit overcrowded. Million is hidden, and he spam shots the form. He's getting many kills this way. Don't buy Alexi. <laughs> now all four forces have holding the castle but they're under siege. As Blue Four has a tank up to the hill and managed to get score a lot of kills, but still they have many players in good positions in order to guard the farm and not allow Blue Four players to spawn in attack. Blue Force trying to make a push. But they don't have much base to move because everything is open. Op4 makes a mistake, I think, not observing the outside. Even if they're bombed by the tank, they should put some players on looking the side of the hill. Now they get only one inside. Just bombs a grenade. Now an enemy is going to get from the back side a machine gunner, but uh, Strange has managed to spot him somehow. Grenade goes inside, he makes some circles. He gets himself off to a position and he loses the objective. Mistake there. Now the enemy gets back and shoots him into the back one while he tried to find another cover position. But still, the objective is not for hands. They get two players inside the tower. Tower is being bombed right now. Blue Four is trying to find the respawn truck. They're healing each other inside the, the tower. Op Four is just trying to capture the central base the objective, while Blue Four is. Playing a bit more aggressively, Blue were played by Abbott, and here we get Simmons. Malian has a, uh, assumed a good position there, observing the farm. They know that the respawn truck of Blue 4 is there. Now Simmons gets hit by Alessandro while he was in aggressive position, but Blue has one player passed in front to the front searching for the truck. It is HML with a sniper rifle. He tries to find the respawn truck. I believe they know where it must be. I think he has spotted the respawn truck. And now he's gonna make something happen here, let's see. Now the respawn truck of Blue 4 is in danger. HML can take down the respawn truck now. He's making a run for it. Where is he going? He throws a grenade on it. First grenade on it. I think it would be enough to destroy it, but still, he could try to throw one more. Nope, it's destroyed. Now, Shum. Shum. Big. I hope I pronounce it right. 
is here and red forces played by Ha are making a very good push here they've actually managed to take down almost the entire blue force of Abakan and they're holding this position here not allowing them to play the game how they want it even though Abakan has a tank on the hill still I think the blue for respawn truck is destroyed This is a script actually that allows you to spot um, who is holding each vehicle. Let's see what HML can do here. It's trying to make a push for it. Backside of the castle. HCCP has assumed a good position on the farm. It will be kinda hard for Blue 4 to enter this place. As you can see there are many dead bodies there. You know the flag one player is taking an RPG. HML is trying to find a good position. He takes a home V. He spots some enemies and I believe he listens to the respawn truck coming. Simon just make a push for the motorbike. HML is has an enemy behind him. Should be observing the else. Oh he hasn't spotted him yet. There's a fire coming now. He spots his enemy and he takes him down. Takes the Humvee and he's trying to make a push inside the base. He gets out of the Humvee and he's... An RPG goes off. I believe this was for the tank. Now HML is trying to find a good position to hide but... I believe that he's exposed right now. But he scores a kill on an enemy and now with his attempt will side hold the farm the central location, the castle, sorry for that. The other enemy player is uh, in the tower that's destroyed. I get sporadic fire and engagements all around the castle right now. The respawn trucks played way defensively and way back by Hasis because they saw that they lost it now. Shmbinga is going for the tank. The tank hasn't spotted him and he has a chance to make something happen here. Walked a very long distance to come up here. The tank is moving right now. Let's see what he can do. Bad luck for him, the tank had decided that they would need to advance. Now TDT is taking a position, observing the crossroads and the yellow building. He's trying to hit the enemy but the ground is not quite good yet, he needs to move a bit forward. He's exchanging fire, we see in the background the tank advancing. He managed to score a kill but now the tank has spotted him. No, it's going to run him over. Oh my god, it passed over him. Bad play there. You shouldn't be abusing the enemies, you should just play to win. Simon has taken a position here, trying to kill the enemy attackers now. We get a uh, strange exchange of fire here, but finally Lions killed by Simon Simon should have used his rifle. I don't know if he had bullets or something. Now the blue four tank is making circles to the map trying to find the enemy respawn troop. That was a good look. He's trying to find a solution of how he's going to attack since the backside is almost destroyed by the tank. And there's no much cover if he tries to get in, but still he can score a kill on the sniper there. I think he has spotted him, but he's trying to decide whether he's going to attack from this side or get from the bunker side. 
he throws on uh, two three, but on uh, two three doesn't open. He crushes in front. One more goes off. Now we get two motorbikes moving forward. I don't know if the respawn truck was destroyed here. Lion is in the center, he's trying to get a better position to defend the base. He picks up uh, an RPG in the GB25 rifle. At least he's trying to. Alexei is making a push. Simmons is in the wooden. In the wooden. Yes, he thinks he has spotted an enemy on the backside of his team. Um, I think that both teams are trying to play um, solid play, nothing new, nothing crazy, but uh, for some reason maybe can were not helped by this, even though they played blue for side in the first round that we now, since blue for side is, has more advantage in this map I guess, I think. they're trying to make big circles. I don't know what they're hoping to achieve but Op4 has many players inside the zone. The tank is making big circles again. He's trying to find the enemy respawn truck but I think they don't have one. The maps are meant to be played on four bases, four bases and now that there are six players on each side you see that there are many players here. Oh, Messer gets out of the tank. What happened there? What happened here? I don't understand. What is going on? What was that? This thing is driving me crazy. He was... he ejected and then he went back to base. Don't know what to say. Here we can see the opposing force truck. If you see, if you look at the background, where the center of the screen is high up below the spectating figure, I think that this is it. I'm not quite sure that lion is trying to chase the respawn truck, the Abrams too. If Op4 managed to get the Abrams, now Blue Four will be in a lot of trouble. Simmons is trying to find a way to get inside and he scores a kill on. The Cendric that was uh, the Sergic. It was on the top of the Humvee. 50 caliber over in the farm. Now, Blue for Forces have advanced way further down to Gorka village to stop the enemy advancement. Similar as far as an M203, but it's not successful. I'm just trying to place it inside the. But now it's a pretty hard situation. He fires one more. He's trying to place it inside the bunker but he misses and he gets killed now we get RPGs fired on the tank I guess what we got here Lion fires an RPG the script here has stuck for me you know enable the missile camera oh I did but now mess Lion with the tank managed to find Mesa that was far the RPG on him and takes him down. Ibekin has moved forward to the village of Goka, trying to stop enemy advancements. Glock here is firing a motorbike driver. He misses him and gives him the chance to move back. Now throws a grenade on him. One more. As you can see here, Hassi Speed does not have a respawn truck in play, they just push with motorbikes but and now they're bringing the tank. The the truth is that since they get they get um they had at least like four players inside the zone, they didn't really need to bring a respawn truck. Just delaying the enemy and now we get one blue four player here inside the zone, HML and three up four no one one up four to one blue four. 
I believe the T90 is going to chase. Now Hamillion gets Alexei, who's near the zone. I'm gonna try to get to the tank here because we're gonna, we're gonna have a tank fight. Since I believe the T90 is supposed to go and chase down Mesa, driving the Abrams. One small detail here, uh, he should try to turn to the other side because the back side of the Abrams is less armored. One of the few realistic things that are inside armor too. It's a big fight there in the, at the tower. Let's see if the tank manages to get a kill there. As you can see the script is problematic. Now, blue, there's a strange situation here, the OP4 has managed to get the base, but even though OP4 uh, uh, OP has the base, but OP4 has been blocked from the entering zone to the battle. Now we get some fire there. It's Mesa trying to hit tank, he fires one good shot, and I think the T90 is destroyed now. This is a very hard situation now for our CCP, even though they got a score advantage, I guess, from holding this zone for a longer time. Now I can slowly and methodically manage to get the hold of the objective. Now we get a grenade throw there. I believe they know that the enemy, the OP4 players, are inside the tower. They haven't noticed that yet. Oh, they're both inside the bunker there. Now one of them is down. The other one is waiting in. Has him. I don't know if they have understood that he is inside there. He's taking a good defensive position. If anyone tries to screen again, he's gonna be having the initiative into shooting now now blue 4 has more players than op 4 inside the objective and they have captured it but one of them slips out and resets the countdown now op 4 is up one more player coming to the zone there's um... Lysandric is trying to make something happen here and he pushes from the back side Blue for players should be observing who's entering instead of hiding with just holding the objective. As you can see, one is above the other. It's kind of strange situation here. Blue for player looks from the other side. You now he won't even be able to see him looking from this side. I think that the tank is um. Now, Lysergic has spot the enemy from firing the M203 and he's going for the grenade. Now he chooses to throw it to another player, but he then finally shoots him with the AK. At least he knows that an enemy is above him. Strange situation there. I think that uh, the tank is disabled there, it cannot move but still has blockaded the central way and managed to score a kill there. I don't know if this was a respawn truck, I see a lot of flames. So it must not be a UAZ. And now, good, uh, again, strange play there. Has SCP manages to get hold of the castle even though their entrance is blocked and Blue 4 has the respawn truck uh, more close to it. Here's one Ebe can play inside the castle, and two, one op four, one from Ha, one other one is near Lion. We're coming from motorbikes. Vizion is trying to make a push for it. As I said before, playing this match that was designed for four and four bases with the six player makes things kind of hard because uh, the map gets overcrowded and you get. You cannot cover it with enough players since you got 
more coming from different sides. I think that uh, they try to find where the enemy is. Oh, here we get a friendly fire, and Simmons get gets injured by the M203 of his co-player. But still, he manages to hold a place and get more players than the op for team. The op for team has to walk a uh, very big distance. Bizon is killed by Hasm. Now we get here Alexei moving inside on the broken tower. They destroyed one and he's trying to spot the enemy. Since the zone is blue, but they know that at least one player is there. They get some fire inside the bunker. They have spotted him and now the RPG will go on him. Messer scars two kills with uh, the tank. Down Gorka. And now Hazem is destroyed by chewing down the bunker with the RPG by Alexei. Simon sees the enemy that and has slipped by and get inside the castle. There's going no, uh, an M203, but he doesn't manage to score a kill him. HML was inside the tower. I guess. If I manage to find where he is. No, I don't think he was inside the tower, but managed to score a kill on him. Messer is with a tank here on Gorka. Observing the way now, as you can see here, only one output player is, um, has managed to slip past through the blue four forces and trying to make something happen. I think he goes for respawn truck, and the open for player have to walk all the way. Motorbikes. Well, there was a marker here. I don't know if anybody spotted them. Another marker goes off there. Yeah. See what we got here. DDD is behind the farm. I think he'll manage to get a kill on the respawn truck now. There's a blue for play there. He's trying to defend the truck. Has he spotted any more? Just random precaution. I don't know. But DDD managed to get a good position. I think he's fired upon by the sniper. He stops there. He shouldn't stop there. Throws a uh, grenade on the respawn truck. I don't think he, f he managed to hit it. The second one misses completely. Now the blue for player knows where exactly he is. He managed to get the tractor though. Oh, he manages to. No, Block gets a kill on DDT that should have played a more calm. more calmly. And now Op4 tries to find a good position to attack. HML has assumed the position here a bit outside the castle to observe the back side of the hill. There are the blue four forces move the respawn truck as the enemy knew where it was. I don't think they really need to do that right now. Now two Op4 forces manage to get slip and get inside the castle. And Alexei managed to score a kill on Hazm. Jundrick gets a hold of the... Inside the... No. In front of the medical tent. There are two players there, holding the base. And the Siemens manages to get a kill on one, but the other one gets him. So we get two on one situation here inside the castle. And as you can see here, if they haven't moved the respawn truck, there will be more. He's one to come now. Grenade goes on the broken tower. The classic position. The first one misses, the second one misses too. But now he managed to get but both or get killed with by this tent. And the first round is over. 152 points for Epic and 196 points for HCCP. HCCP manages to hold the objective for a longer time and that gave them the advantage of scoring more points.
Abakan should totally have won this. They missed the respawn track at the beginning with the tank. This is a very interesting in close game though. But still the blue full side has the advance advantage so they could have done something better, at least win the round. Now let's see what is going to happen in the next one. And here you can see the scoreboard. There's a lot of kills by Mesa driving the tank and Hamillion. The second round begins now. I can will assume the up 4 row and Han CCP will get the blue 4. Here is the second round for the AC tournament between um, Abakan and Hans SCP. Um, we managed, we didn't manage to get the, the beginning of the game as my computer crashed armor basically. Uh, it seems that uh, Blue 4 playing by Ha managed to capture the castle right now. Here we get a stuck home V to a tree. DDD gets out. Ha holds the castle now, having inside three players as far as I can see. Uh, again, this is a bit, of a bit of trouble right now. They got broad tank here inside the base. This will help me. It will help them a lot with the defense. Now we get Luke taking the SPG. I think he's going to try to make a run and destroy the respawn truck, maybe. Now Abigail is trying to make a push for it. Bison is positioned behind the tower and he's spamming with the GV25. He has spotted now. He's taking fire from the tower. On the window, he's firing no, more GV25. Exchange of fire here. M16 to GB25, he gets hit. He's in a rough position right now. Gluck is taking the SPG back to base. Bizon was killed there. The T90 is taking a very far position right now with Messer as the driver of it. He's maybe trying to spot the tank now, he's trying to spam to the castle. Sean Bigger is outside the base. Trying to spot anyone that's gonna get behind it. Simmons is way back. Now we get a shot there. Try to make a big circle, but didn't come to any use. Abigail is having a hard time to deploy their forces right now. This ha has a complete control of the, uh, the castle with many players inside, and all the players um, placed around in various defensive positions. Cosm there picks an RPG to defend maybe the truck in case something armored comes through. We get Chumiga there observing the road. Abagans having a very slow deployment right now. Let Ha get scoring points. A million dies somehow, I think he respawned or something. Alexei is running to the, for the forest. As you can see, things are quite quiet. 
Op 4 is just firing at the respawn truck there with the tank at the farm. Mess are driving it. Helm tries to spot where the fire comes from and he gets the respawn truck. Good play there. Still doesn't quite threat. Blue 4 that has a big point advantage keeps scoring points. Glock tries to move the Humvee from this position, but seems stuck. He's in trying to make a push, but he was spotted and killed. Messers tries to do something there. He's firing to the farm, to the to the farm. Yes, and he destroys a Humvee that was stationed there. Two more points for Abigan. Look for one more GP25. Messers managed to get Shamvega from a long distance. Lufour does not have a respawn truck and play right now, but they have to play the whole force and have many players inside the location. I think that Ha have cleared the game even if Abakan manages to manage to get the the, the form the the tower, the castle, I'm sorry for um the score difference is very hard to cover since they've been scoring from the beginning of the game and have an advantage from the last round on the first round. As was tries to spot the tank maybe make something happen there. Now Alexei is near the base. He might try to get inside the zone. Abba can have matched their forces outside the castle. Now we're gonna have a big fight there. Sendrick gets a kill on him. Simmons is trying to make a push here. Hedgemon is trying to push from the back. They got um, suppressing the, the castle from the tank. Messer gets a kill there. Look makes a push. I think he's going to try to get past the castle and try to score a kill on the respawn. Now we we'll get a kill there by Siemens. I believe that Abakan lost the respawn truck at the beginning of the game that he didn't manage to capture. And this has made them for a troublesome deployment right now. Now they got the they've managed to get the castle into two. The Abrams is there. With only one player inside. HML could try to get an RPG and hit the truck no, the tank that tries to spot and where the enemies are. Now we get a close shot there on the Abrams. I believe that if he's directed by his teammates, he made he may manage to try and hit the tank. More shots are coming here. Messer, I think, fires to the farm right now. He may have spotted the respawn truck. No, he's trying to hit the tank, I believe, by direction of the sniper HML here. Three up four places right now inside the zone. Ha is in a big bit of trouble right now. HML decides to go and get an RPG, I think. But now there's a mistake there, the tank uh, injures him. But oh, great shot! The Abrams is destroyed, even though. And 
helpful ploy for forces played by Abek and managed to get a hold of the castle. And now we're getting a blue for player get inside. Hasm tries to spot the enemy on the top of the tower. And he scores a kill, but there goes a grenade on him. And Abek can still hold the base. How the castle is destroyed, as you can see right now. Hello. Now, Gluck managed to get a kill on the last defender of the farm. Abek and will bring the tank forth. They have eliminated the whole blue fort team. They've managed to turn the game. Let's see if the points they're gonna score are gonna give them the victory. Now Hamelin here is trying to find the enemy that was inside the base. He's holding his pistol. I don't know why. It's a strange picture here. He managed to spot the enemy. Yes, and he's gonna get pistol kill there. <laughs> Great play there by both of the players. This is the first pistol kill of the tournament. Still, I guess if he had the M24, he would. This wouldn't have come to him. Lion is bringing the tow in order to try to do something with the tank there. Let's see. Trying to spot it. Messer is scoring a kill right now with heavy machine gun. Lion is trying to find the tank, but from this position he doesn't. He's not able to see it because the hill is blocking his fall. Field of view. Simon scores a kill there, and all four have managed to get the castle in. Though there's a play in. Lufour is trying to get inside again. Lion taken from the back side that was placed in the village with the machine gun. And OP4 is bringing the T90 with Mesa at the front. Now he tries to, he manages to hide inside the tower. And both sides now share the points. Habak should place one more play there. happened there I lost I chose to I think that Messer we lost a pretty good scene there We lost a pretty good scene there, I think that Lion manages to dis- Oh no, I think the script is playing some tricks on us. You know, Messer is destroying a motorbike for extra points. Lion is trying to find the tank again, but still he doesn't have the field of view. DD is losing connection right now. So how will we with one less player? Messer scores one kill on Hamillion. Yep, the tank is bringing high into a very hard situation. I believe that Abbekan, if they still play this solid play and move the respawn truck further forth, they can actually win the game, even though we lost with a kind of kind of big difference of about 40 points in the first one. Now, Messer managed to find another player here in the woods and kills him. Now pushing back. Let's see what Lion will manage to do here. And we'll get motorbike like rush. Mm -hmm. 
I believe that they don't want to lose the Humvee as it's the last resort. Do not go in a direct attack on the tank. Get some bugs here with the, with the tank. I don't know what happens. Simmons is outside watching the highway. We got a rush here with the surgic with the motorbike. I don't think I don't know if this is lag or something. The tank destroys the motorcycle for extra points. Mercer is pushing forward now with now how Lion can get a kill with the tow. He will spot the tank I guess. He see he can see it from this position. But it's kinda hard to fire shot from this first round goes off. I don't know if he managed to hit the tank. But now Mr. spots him and kills him. Good play there. I don't know if the tank was hit by this one. Now he's firing the Humvee to destroy it. And now all anti-armor capabilities of Blue 4 are destroyed. Humvee Lysenjik has an RPG and fires on the tank. More RPGs. He's now on the fire. The tank is damaged a lot. I think it's going to explode now. Yep. And Messer is down. Uh, Abakan could have played a more defensive play with the tank and not losing it. Because they give points to the enemies plus their advantage. Now Blue 4 is trying to make a push. Uh, up 4, played by Abakan, should push now. They have the advantage, they have the, the tower, the whole, they score points. They should not allow the enemy team to advance. I don't know what HML is trying to find that has has reached the tower somehow. He's not going to try to get in. There's no enemies threatening them from this position. Only at the top of the tower, I guess. He spots an enemy. He's trying to get him. Now a grenade goes off inside the base. But with no effect, now another one. The other flag, an enemy is near the medical tent right now. And I think he's waiting for him to appear. And now an enemy goes and engages him. He finds him. He misses first shot. We get an exchange of fire from close distance there. Now he tries to kill the enemy and he manages to score a kill. There are more defenders inside the base. Now Blue 4 brings the respawn truck ahead, they need to make an aggression and Up 4 brings the respawn truck after all this time both teams were with no respawn truck Blue 4 is making a run for it, the sniper is firing on the Siemens and Hasm get killed each other, Messer gets killed online Blue 4 is pushing. How can make it happen? I guess if they force, the forces. Sir, the syringe gets killed there. He's trying to make a run for it. I think he's going to try and fight the Alp 4 respawn truck. It's in a pretty obvious position right now, since the reinforcements are constant and they can understand that they're coming from behind somewhere. This is pretty standard placement for the respawn truck by Op4. We do not really see any creative play by both teams. They go for a certain and solid play, something tested before, and that seems to be working in general. Now, many Blue 4 players get inside the base, as it's totally destroyed, and there are many passages. In fact, Four, no, five blue for players are near the base or inside it. The upper force is in trouble right now. We get a grenade throw there.
now the castle is controlled by blue four and now they're pushing forward trying to chase the respawn truck the only up for play here is one in the tower script won't allow us to see the players really see this very problems and now the last up for play is killed and Right now, Haas SCP hold it, the, build, the base. I believe that this is the end of the match. Hope for his way behind to cover a very big distance right HML though is behind the force of blue. Uh, he can make something happen if he is not spotted. He's making a push now. Let's see what he can do. I don't think that anybody has spotted him yet. So he can score kills right now. But now he's spotted by Lysergic and Lysergic gets him. We saw a pretty standard play by both teams in the placement, but still there was no aggression by both of them. We saw respawn trucks um, being totally neglected in a very big part of the game, and that gave uh, the advantage to the f one team at the beginning, then the, the building, the, the zone changed hands, and then again changed hands to the other team, to Ha right now. And began hard it for a long time, but still didn't manage to get a hold of it. If they had brought a respawn truck, I guess, uh, forward when they have wiped the whole hard team, they could have not lost it. Also, their their aggression with uh, with the tank uh, made them lose it. They could have held it for a longer time. Now, why we can massively attack to the side? We get here a uh, look that's right way forward. And uh, Hamillion is trying to spot something here with the uh, sniper being in the backside holding the base. There's much killing involved to the zone. Wish the script could work better. He's on fire as a GB25. The surgic gets one more kill. His own spams, I think, at the base. He doesn't really spot anything. It's a blind search there. He's under fire, I guess. He should try to get, find some cover. Lies down. Now we get an attempt from the backside by HML. It's kind of hard to attack here that you get no cover, but he still managed to get a good position. He knows where the surgeon is and he fires a grenade on him. He misses the first one, the second one. Will be better? No, the second one goes way far further. Get to one on four situation here, kinda hard. HML knows where his enemy is, I think he could try something. And he gets a kill on him, good headshot there. But he's fired upon, he's injured now, he's down by a lion. Who is huh, waiting him here, having a very good defensive position right now, covering the whole fire zone. Bison here makes a push. Might actually try to get inside the zone. Kind of hard to move that. He should um, remove his uh, weapon view right now because he makes him crawl slower. He does it and he moves. Inside the base, he looks to the bunker. There must be an enemy there. It's uh, a very classic position. And now I can manage to overwhelm uh, Ha and they get four players inside the zone. They change of fire line and manage to get a kill. And now inside the tower, there is uh, Hasm that managed to get one more kill. Now it's a 2 and 2. 
Simon fires a grenade. He hasn't managed to spot really where the enemy is. Look at this picture right now. With the back one, with the other. He still spams his grenades. I don't think that they have managed to spot where a lion is. Now he spots a blue for play the game with a motorbike. He decides to push further. They need the points right now, they need to score kills. Simmons managed to get a kill there. Good shot. I believe that the the six versus six mode that they're testing here uh, might be winning many of their tactics because get a grenade throw there on the broken. And Simmons makes a mistake and kills his teammate there. One more grenade. He throws it uh, to a position that he could not throw it himself. Now Lion here spots him. Oh, Simmons spots the enemy. He's trying to hide. But now he, he didn't spot his enemy really. And he's he shot to the back by Lion. And the base is held by Blue 4. Again. HML tries to do something here. They try to kill the player inside the tower, I guess. But still not gonna happen. I don't think there is much coordination by Epic and White now because now there's a grenade going off inside the tower and the final grenade gets him. Good play there. Epic has sold has shown in past tournaments that they're a good team with good tactics and solid play. Now I don't know what the problem is with them, but I guess that not much coordination, big number of players, and I think that they should have practiced more this, uh, this specific type of play. Still, they're making a very good work, being with the back of the wall for a long time. They've managed to turn tables twice right now, like now. They get the hold of the base. Um, Lion should be dead by now, as they should have spotted where exactly he is. But no, and they did not try to engage him. Humvee comes here now, my GDT is getting inside the base. I believe this happens just to secure the area. He looks at the back side with a 50 cal. The op 4 player here tries to do something, he's hidden inside the tower. He's injured. I don't don't go out, please. He's he's going to try to go out. Look at this picture here. But oh, good shot there by Alexei. I think if he managed to go to the top of the tower, he will score many kills and disrupt the enemies. Now the fifty cal goes off. All this time the fighting has begun. Has come up for. Managed to get hold of the farm, but still not enough to turn the tables. The second round is won by Ha again by just about 15 points. Very good game there. Um, it was a good game. Ab again is eliminated from the tournament, and Ha Mississippi advances to the loser bracket because this was a loser bracket game. Hard and fierce match. Hope you enjoyed, and see you next time.